I'm just looking out for you, boo boo. That's that's all I really want to do. I just I just want to look out for you because you know I'm that's that's just what I do. back with another video if you are new then hey boo go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already join the gang be sure to also ring that bell so that way you're alerted whenever i upload a new video and to all my returning subscribers welcome back we always happy to have you guys back to check out a brand new video so today is going to be episode 21 of my entrepreneur her series so get ready we're about to be talking about some things that you can do while we're locked in while we're trapped in the house during this quarantine this is just me giving you guys some ideas as to how to keep you know yourself productive focus on your business um that i figured might help you if you are a business owner so if you're interested in figuring out what these tips are then stay tuned so i do have my notebook right here this is where i jot down all my ideas for youtube videos i did go ahead and write the notes down in the book so if you see me looking down that is why just, just want to put that out there so the very first thing that I would suggest if you are a business owner is for you to audit your site now is the best time to do it if you especially have, if you have a second job sometimes that can um, you know take a lot of your day and if you aren't an essential worker and you're not working right now I feel like now is the best time to do this not to say I didn't have time but it kind of was in the back of my mind but while I had this time and we're all home I decided to audit my site now I am uh, modifying the description for a few of the items that I have. I did um, actually film that for you guys, so I'll leave the link for that video up above. So go ahead and check that out. But I feel like now is the best time to audit your site. Make sure your links are working. Make sure it looks just as good on mobile as it does on a desktop. And update your coupons. If there are some coupons that are inactive, you might as well go ahead and delete them if you're not going to be using those coupons again. So the second thing that you can do is to take an update of inventory. So jot down everything if you don't have like an excel sheet just use a regular notebook use a regular use your notepad on your phone just write it down on something so you can have it written down somewhere if you have clothes if you have hair how many bundles of this do i have how many pieces of this pink um of this pink crop top do i have how many lip glosses in clear do i have you know whatever that's a good time to do inventory or take inventory of everything that you have you need to reach out to your vendor to order more as soon as quarantine is over if you're still ordering now what do you need to re go ahead and restock take updated product shots so this is something that i have on my own list i actually want to take some new product shots just for um, my instagram page just to update my website and things of that sort and it's always nice to just have different pictures to post especially on instagram sometimes things can get repetitive um, so new pictures are always a great way to add new content to your feed. You can take it on your iPhone. My iPhone is crap right now. Currently still, I know I've said it months ago, I need to update it. But I use my camera, my Canon GX7 a lot of times to take my product shots. Anyway, transfer it to my phone and then upload it on Instagram. Use what you got, okay? Build an email list. This is very important because email lists help you to keep in contact with people that are not already on like social media or if they're not on social media every day. I personally check my email every single day and I'm sure a lot of Americans are a lot of people do in general so if you are sending an email chances are they're gonna see your email before they might log on Instagram and let, get lost on your feed you know take this time to build your email list create a hashtag list for Instagram promo I personally have my hashtag list in my notes that have hashtags for the stitch life so if I'm posting something on my personal the stitch life Instagram which you should follow go ahead and follow me on Instagram don't worry I'll wait and if you haven't already subscribed by this point and I'm dropping gems, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. We love to see it. We love to have you and we appreciate the support. But yeah, as I was saying before, I have a hashtag list for Instagram, my personal Instagram at the Stitch Life, where if I'm posting a beauty picture or something along those lines, I have a hashtag list for that. So along with my caption, I'll go ahead and pop that in and that can hopefully generate um, more people to my page. And for Capra NYC, I do have a... Uh, list of hashtags that i use on my business page at capra ny to help again draw engagement to my page get new um followers on that page the next thing is to organize your workspace so i do have a little mini office in my room um if you guys want to update a video on my mini office let me know i'll actually pin that as a comment down below and the amount of, if i get 10 likes on it i'll do an updated one if you are interested in that go ahead and like that comment down below um but yeah now's a good time to update your workspace so in addition to doing inventory just take that time 
time to organize your business cards organize your thank you cards organize your stickers or whatever else you may have in that area make some graphics for future sales or just for your pages in general if you guys would like to put up quotes sometimes it's nice to make your own quotes and go ahead and add your own handle on that I've been doing that on my page every now and then I'll make my own um, graphic and I do have a link for a video if you guys are still struggling to figure out how to make your own graphics you can't afford to pay anyone to make graphics for you and you might be just a little bit creative then go ahead and check that video out I'll leave it up above for you guys if you're interested in how I personally make some of my graphics for my Instagram for my business Instagram then I'll leave that link above for you guys at your convenience we have a birthday sale coming up you can design get that out of the way right now so that when the time comes all you have to do is prep your inventory for the sale you already have the graphics basically all set up and ready to post you smart Research new items or new products. Now's a good time to just search for new vendors. If you're looking for a new item that you'd like to add to your site or add to your business, now's a good time to do it. I mean, what, what, what? We <laughs> Eric is now stuck on the letter M. You got free time right now. Like, I'm just looking out for you, boo boo. That's, that's all I really want to do. I just, I just want to look out for you because, you know, I'm, that's, that's just what I do. You're loyal. You're grateful. I appreciate that. The next thing is to make highlights for your business page so not everyone has highlights on their business page but i feel like it's a great way for someone that's just getting on your instagram to figure out who you are figure out what you have figure out who you cater to they're kind of like a snaps but it, it stays on your page so you know after 24 hours or whatever your story disappears a highlight you can actually pin it on your page and leave it there if someone comes on your page and they're just looking through your photos say they don't see enough in all your photos they can go to your highlights and see different things like behind the scenes or about me just stuff like that and all your products you can leave that all in the highlighted sections i did update a few of my highlights in one of my last videos i'll leave that up above you kind of see what i mean i updated my policy and I updated like mink maintenance so just so that if you are on my page and you were interested in what my shipping policy maybe or my return policy I put it on the highlights now's a good time to update your highlights or make some highlights or just edit your highlights if you have some old things in there that are not of any uh, that are not of relevance delete those out you know just clean it all up and the last thing the last tip that I have is for you to rest and reflect so this is something that I still have to do but just think back like how far has my business came is there anything that I would like to change later on down the road is there anything that I want to add later on down the road or what can I take away from you know these last few months of being a business owner these last few months of sales also take it easy on yourself if things are not going as great as you would like them to be I understand like this season is just like definitely put a damper on a lot of small business owners I definitely want you guys to be easy on yourself as well like it's okay to reflect it's okay to take a step back like okay what can we do moving forward do so I, I definitely encourage people to just don't stress yourself out too much about stuff but I feel for you boo I do so that is the end of today's video i hope you guys really enjoyed if you did indeed enjoy go ahead and leave me a big thumbs up smash it smash that like button so that way i know and i can create continue to create content like this for you guys um go ahead and comment down below what should i let you guys comment down below comment down below a green heart since my shirt is kind of camo go ahead and comment a green heart if you have made it to the end of today's video and let me know down below what you guys have been doing during this lockdown during this quarantine um to just better your business again if you made it this far and you haven't subscribed i hope that you do subscribe and join the gang and also ring that bell to be alerted every single time that your girl uploads a new video i love you guys so so much thank you guys so much for all of your support again and i'll see you guys all in the next upload bye so these are just some tips 10 these are just so these are just so these are just tenting so these so yeah creative um then i understand create create a hashtag list these are the liners your business to help um structure for your labels organize um then i understand we'd love to have you we'd love to go ahead and a hashtag they are along there. I, 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 I like you like that. Go buy your mama a house. Go buy your whole family houses. Put this money in your savings account. Go spend some money for no reason.